Third. Sarah, good morning. The first bell here rings at Grantsville High in about an hour, and some students who go to school here say it'll be a somber day on campus. Now, the community rallying support for the family. 400 people attended a vigil last night at Grantsville City Park, just across the street from the high school, to remember the victims. After police confirm 52 year old Alejandra Haney, Grantsville High student Alexis Haney, and Excelsior Academy students Matthew and Milan Haney, were shot and killed by who police say was a teen relative. This morning, Tooele County School says grief counselors will be on site at all Grantsville area schools to assist students and staff cope with their loss. Students remembering the lives of their classmates. Alexis was a very good friend of mine. We played soccer together. Something I will always remember about her is she would always tell me how capable and amazing I was. Such a sad story here. Now, at the vigil last night, a letter was read from the surviving family members. In part, the depth of sorrow we feel is matched by the overwhelming outpouring of love we feel from the Grantsville and surrounding community. And the community placing these yellow ribbons around the area to signify some remembrance for the family here. At last check, the community has raised about $85,000 to help cover funeral costs and to pay for the surviving dad's medical costs. Reporting live, Jared Jatsonini, ABC4 News.